A modern board file has many layers besides the traditional copper and silk layers. Documentation layers like assembly and fabrication can help in drilling and populating the board. Assembly drawings are typically coming from footprints while the content of the fab layer is auto-generated. The paste layer is used to specify where to dispense solder paste for reflow soldering. Data is typically coming from pad stacks of footprints. The mask layer specifies solder resist openings and similar to the paste layer is usually specified in the pad stacks of footprints. In PCB R&D all these layers are available for custom drawn objects. Just select the layer and draw lines, arcs, polygons or text on it. This can be used to create custom mask openings or paste patterns over traces that need to be made vertically thicker for high current. Custom drawings on the assembly layer may help with visualisation of cables and plugs that would be plugged in once the board is assembled. The fab layer can host remarks on how the board needs to be fabricated. There are buttons on the bottom of the layer selector to show or hide all layers. There must be at least one layer visible, so the Hide All button hides all layers but the currently active one. A shortcut to focus on a single layer is selecting that layer and hiding all layers. Physical layers are represented by layer groups in PCB R&D, while layers are just drawing canvases. A single layer group can host multiple layers, which are composited for rendering and export. For example, we can create three top silk layers within the top silk layer group and make the second layer negative by enabling the sub for subtract flag. Compositing happens in the order of layers within the layer group, from top to bottom. Objects on positive layers draw, objects on negative layers erase. Order of creating the object doesn't matter. We can draw a new thin positive line under an already existing thick negative line, and the negative line will erase into the positive line. The third positive layer is rendered last, so it goes above the negative layer and can put back silk over the thick erase line. Compositing works on any layer group type, except for copper layers. In fact, the mask layer group is implemented with a single negative layer. When the first layer within a group is negative, a whole board initial fill is created before rendering the first layer. Any object drawn on this layer will erase from the initial no board fill. Layer compositing is a powerful tool to draw complicated shapes, most often used to make paste and mask patterns. The majority of the drawing objects, such as lines, arcs, polygons and text, are layer objects, which means a single object is always on a single layer. Layer objects can be moved to the currently selected layer individually using the context menu or in groups by selecting them and moving selection using the menu or the hotkey SL.
subcircuits are not layer objects, as they use multiple layers. A similar operation for subcircuits is moving them to the other side of the board.